Ever thought about the highest peaks that tower over our world? What makes each unique? Mountains are more than just magnificent landscapes. They are the guardians of our ecosystems, home to diverse wildlife, and a playground for thrill-seekers and adventurers. Each peak has a story to tell, a mystery to unravel. Today, we're going to count down the top 10 highest mountains in our world, revealing their secrets and exploring their unique features. So buckle up, adventurers, let's embark on a journey to explore these magnificent peaks. Starting off our countdown at number 10, we have Annapurna in the Himalayas. This majestic mountain range in Nepal is not just a sight for sore eyes, but also a challenge for the most daring climbers. Annapurna towers above the landscape at an impressive height of 26,245 feet. What makes Annapurna unique, you ask? Well, it is not just its height, but also its stunning natural beauty. The mountain is home to a diverse array of wildlife and plant species, making it a paradise for nature enthusiasts. It also has a deadly allure. Despite its beauty, Annapurna has the highest fatality rate among the world's 10 tallest peaks. This combination of breathtaking beauty and peril makes it an irresistible draw for climbers from around the globe. So that was Annapurna, a mountain that offers beauty and danger in equal measure. Moving on to number nine, we have Nanga Parbat, also known as the Killer Mountain. Nestled in the Diamer district of Gilgit Baltistan in Pakistan, this formidable mountain is a sight to behold. Towering at a majestic height of 26,660 feet, it's the ninth highest peak in the world. But don't let its beauty fool you. The Killer Mountain has a reputation for being one of the most dangerous mountains to climb, with a high fatality rate among climbers. Its southern face, known as the Rupal Face, is considered the highest mountain face in the world. It's not just a mountain, but a symbol of the extremes of nature's beauty and danger. Nanga Parbat is also unique, as it's the westernmost peak of the Himalayas, standing solitary and distinct from the rest of the range. Nanga Parbat, a peak that is as deadly as it is breathtaking. Next on our list, at number 8, we have Manaslu, and at number 7, Dalajiri. Nestled in the heart of the Himalayas, Manaslu, known as the Mountain of the Spirit, stands majestically at a height of 8,156 meters. This peak is famous for its challenging terrain and the unique cultural experience it offers, with its route passing through rural Nepalese settlements. Just a stone's throw away, we find Dalajiri, the White Mountain, soaring to an impressive height of 8,177 meters. It's a behemoth that demands respect and offers an exhilarating climb. Its distinctive, almost symmetrical, icy peak has been a beacon for mountaineers since the early 1960s. Both these mountains with their daunting heights and breathtaking landscapes offer more than just a climb. They offer a journey, a pilgrimage of sorts, that tests the limits of human endurance and spirit, two mountains that challenge and inspire climbers worldwide. At number six, we have Cho Oyu, the turquoise goddess. Nestled in the heart of the Himalayas, straddling the border of Nepal and Tibet, this majestic peak stands tall and proud. Rising to a staggering height of 26,906 feet, Cho Oyu is a sight to behold. Not just a mountain, Cho Oyu is a test of endurance, a challenge for the brave, and a symbol of the indomitable spirit of mountaineers worldwide. She is not just a mountain of rock and ice, but a mountain of dreams, ambitions, and courage. Cho Oyu is known for her unique features. Her slopes are gentle, her summit plateau wide. The climb may not be as technically challenging as some of her sister peaks, but the thin air and extreme weather conditions make the ascent to her summit a formidable task. Cho Oyu, a turquoise beauty that stands tall and proud. Next, we have Makalu at number five and Lhotse at number four. Let's start with Makalu, an imposing giant located 14 miles east of Everest in the Mahalangur Himalayas of Nepal. Makalu stands tall at an impressive 27,838 feet, making it the fifth highest peak in the world. This mountain is renowned for its pyramid-like shape and the sharp contrast it presents against the sky. Moving on to Lhotse, the fourth highest peak in the world. Lhotse, with its towering height of 28,210 feet, is located directly south of Mount Everest. It is unique in that it shares part of its route with Everest, 
making it a favorite among climbers looking for an extra challenge. Both Makalu and Lotz offer climbers a unique experience with their individual challenges and breathtaking views. These two mountains, standing tall, remind us of nature's grandeur. Kangchenjunga takes the third spot in our countdown. Nestled on the border between Nepal and Sikkim, India, this majestic mountain boasts a height that's nothing short of awe-inspiring. Kangchenjunga stands tall at a whopping 8,585 meters, a towering figure that dominates the horizon. But what sets Kangchenjunga apart isn't just its height. This mountain is unique for its five peaks, each over 8,000 meters high, symbolizing the five repositories of God. Gold, silver, gems, grain, and holy books. Climbers have long revered these peaks, and local tradition dictates that the very top of Kangchenjunga should remain untouched, a respect that most climbers still abide by today. Brimming with glaciers and stunning ice formations, Kangchenjunga is a paradise for mountaineers and nature lovers alike. Its incredible biodiversity, including the elusive snow leopard and red panda, further adds to its charm. Kangchenjunga, the king of mountains, truly a sight to behold. Just shy of the top spot, we have K2. This monolith of nature, standing tall in the Karakoram Range, is the second highest mountain in the world. It pierces the sky at an incredible height of 8,611 meters. Unlike many of its counterparts, K2 doesn't play favorites with the seasons. Its treacherous slopes remain a daunting challenge throughout the year, earning it the nickname, the Savage Mountain. It's a title well-deserved, for every four climbers who reach the summit, one tragically doesn't make it back. K2's unique pyramid shape adds to its allure, but also to its difficulty. Its steep, icy slopes and volatile weather conditions make it a formidable climb, even for the most experienced mountaineers. The mountain's remoteness, nestled between China and Pakistan, adds another layer to its mystique. It's a place of stunning, raw beauty that truly embodies the wild spirit of the mountains. K2, a mountain that demands respect and challenges even the most seasoned climbers. And now, the moment we've all been waiting for, the highest peak in the world, Mount Everest. Towering at an astonishing 29,029 feet, it's located in the Malangur Himal subrange of the Himalayas straddling the border of Nepal and Tibet. Everest is not just a mountain, it's a testament to the planet's natural grandeur. Its unique features include the Kumbu Icefall, a perilous stretch of crumbling ice, and the Death Zone, an area above 8,000 meters where oxygen levels are dangerously low. The first successful ascent, made by Sir Edmund Hillary and Tenzing Norgay in 1953, remains a landmark event in human history. It's a symbol of our unyielding spirit of adventure and our relentless pursuit of the seemingly impossible. Everest continues to challenge and inspire, drawing climbers from across the globe, each yearning to conquer its mighty peak. Mount Everest, the ultimate symbol of human endurance and adventure. So there you have it, the top 10 highest mountains in the world. We've journeyed from the icy peaks of Annapurna to the towering heights of Everest, each mountain unique in its grandeur and challenges. Every summit tells a story of endurance, of bravery, and the relentless human spirit to explore. If you are as captivated by these majestic peaks as we are, make sure to subscribe for more fascinating content. Until next time, keep exploring.